Hello, I'm Erica Sargent with CBS Chicago. Here are stories making news at this hour. Many parents at Chicago Public Schools are demanding answers about how the district doles out money to repair and upgrade schools. CBS 2's Roseanne Tejas explains. Questions today about a nearly $1 billion capital improvement budget for Chicago Public Schools. Now, some schools are in line to receive millions of dollars for repairs, while others will get absolutely nothing, even though some of them insist that repairs are desperately needed. So how does CPS evaluate where the money goes? That is the question that a lot of parents are asking today. And why does it appear that some mixed majority, excuse me, mixed and majority schools are receiving more than their fair share of the pie than some of the more black, some of the schools with more black and Hispanic students. Some parents feel that that's a trend that they see, they want answers. CPS, however, says that this is a very complicated process involving, as, as one spokesperson put it, many buckets of money. Some of these schools will receive funding in other ways, they say, but parents today are asking for a more thorough explanation and more transparency from Chicago Public Schools. And here is meteorologist Mary Kay Kleist with your forecast. Hi everybody, what a beautiful day around the area. Finally, that slow moving system from our weekend rain is out of the picture. We have 84 degrees, winds are calm for us at O'Hare. Little bit of a lake breeze, it's 75 right now downtown, 79 in Waukegan. We're up to 87 in Ottawa and Aurora, 88 degrees now in Joliet. So what we have happening is Michigan still dealing with that leftover precipitation from the weekend storm as it rotates over the northeast. We have a front we're watching to the west of us and it looks like that's gonna be past through as we go overnight into the early morning hours, but it comes through mainly dry. The only precip we're looking at close to home is the chance of a very spotty stray sprinkle right along that Lake Breeze boundary, much like we saw yesterday, almost just like a little bit of mist, not amounting to anything. So clouds from this afternoon dissipate. We clear out temperatures will drop into the 60s. We'll go with about 66 tonight and then tomorrow. Lots of sunshine, a warm day, especially away from the lake. 87 in Ottawa, 84 to Calb, 85 Aurora and about 80 degrees in Chicago.